Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm just going to be showing you some cool fruit drawings that you can do. And yeah. Oh, also this video is actually inspired by another YouTuber called Amanda Rachel Lee. She does bullet journaling and a bunch of other crafty things. And she did a August bullet journal setup and I think it was 2019 and she used these fruit drawings. So that's where I'm getting my inspiration from. But yeah, let's get to it. So the first fruit that I'm going to be drawing is, I believe, an orange. So basically uh, for this part I'm just drawing half of a circle and then colouring it in yellow. Then I'm going to grab a darker orange, uh, kind of orange in between dark orange and yellow and going around the arc of the circle and colouring it in. And then also drawing two lines in a triangle shape. Then I'm going to draw some seeds for this part of the drawing I only did three but you can also do more than three and then after I've done the seeds I just outlined the orange. Next I'm going to be drawing a strawberry. This is basically a triangle but with curved edges and then you just draw three little oval shapes at the top. Then you outline it and draw some seeds. Next, I'm just going to be drawing a full orange. This is a circle with kind of a tip at the top of the circle. And then you're just going to colour it all in. After you have coloured it all in, I just added uh, some green little oval shapes, kind of like leaves. And then you just want to uh, go around it with a marker. Okay, so the next fruit that I'm going to be doing is actually a kiwi and basically you draw a donut to begin with and then you colour it all in, obviously leaving the centre white and once you've done that you just grab your brown marker and kind of do a 3D effect and draw uh, like the back or the, the skin, sorry, of the kiwi. Once I did that I just outlined the centre of the kiwi and then the outside of it. Then I'm just going to grab my white kind of, it's not a paint pen but it does the same thing and I just drew some seeds. You can also do these in black but I just decided to do it in white because I think sometimes it looks better. Okay so next I'm going to draw a slice of watermelon. So this is uh, just a triangle and then I leave a white space between the green for the skin of the watermelon and then I just outline the triangle and draw some seeds. This next fruit is a lemon. I'm going to show you how to do a green lemon in a minute. It's exactly the same, just a different color. But basically this is an egg shape but with two points instead of rounded. And then you just draw some leaves like we've done before and outline it. To add a bit of interest, I got my jelly roll which is just a white pen and then I added some highlights. Okay, so this next fruit is a lime, um, and so it is just a circle, and then you colour it all in. I didn't have a darker texture, like a darker green for the outline, so I just went over the circle edge again with the same marker, and yeah. Once I'd done that, then I just went around it with my uh, black uh, marker and added the seeds, and then I was done. This fruit uh, is the green lemon, so it's exactly the same as the yellow lemon, just a different colour, I, but I thought I'd still show it anyway. So it's still an egg shape just with points, and then draw some leaves and outline it. Now to do a, another slice of orange, I'm using a orange, a, it's kind of in between yellow and orange and then obviously doing a semicircle. I accidentally got the red. I was supposed to get the dark orange in uh, this part of the video, but anyway. And so then I got my orange, did the outline, and then I got my black and then went around the whole thing and added some seeds.
Uh, this is a slice of watermelon and to do this it's just like the other slices, it is a semicircle. Um, but instead of like doing the outline you leave a gap just like we did with the smaller slice of watermelon and you go around like so and then color it in. Uh, once you've done that then I'm just going to outline it and draw some seeds and then you've got your bigger slice of watermelon. So this is another slice, so for now I'm probably just going to let you uh, sit back, relax and enjoy the video and just watch because I have already explained a similar uh, drawing just with different colours. So yeah. I just wanted to take a moment to just uh, mention uh, what things I'm using, my textures and everything. So for the coloured textures, I'm using the Crayola Super Tips. Uh, I have my fine liner and a Tombow Fudinowski hard tip brush pen. And for the white, I'm using a Jelly Roll size 10. And now, fill the whole page. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please hit that subscribe button and that like button. Um, I've only just got started on my YouTube channel, so I need all the support that I can get. Well, thank you for watching. Bye.